The AARP is encouraging more Georgia seniors to sign up for food stamps. Brandon Burton found out what they're doing to make this happen. Brandon, what exactly did you learn? Thanks, Caroline. The AARP actually had a food, a food stamp drive over in Gainesville today, but my question was, with so many people needing help, why aren't they getting it? Only one-third of Georgia seniors who qualify for food stamps have signed up to get them. With its new SNAP program, the AARP hopes to change that. So as part of our drive to end hunger, uh, we're focusing on some counties in Georgia, trying to do uh, SNAP outreach to a lot of seniors that um, either need assistance in applying or may not know about certain benefits that are out there. The AARP set up at the Blackshear Place Library in Gainesville. A number of volunteers assisted seniors, in many cases informing them what they have available. So our first step in this outreach is really to educate seniors that the benefit is out there and that they are eligible, um, or may be eligible, right, and it's worth a, a, worth a chance in applying or coming and speaking to us um, and asking those questions, clearing up those misconceptions. With so many in need of help and with so much help available, I wanted to know what else was keeping seniors from signing up. Another big obstacle is um, shame. They've been independent for so long, the last thing they want to do is ask for help. So our job in, in this is telling them that it's, it's okay to ask for help and also making them feel safe in doing so. The AARP will be in Gainesville again tomorrow, but if that's a little far for you to travel, you can visit their website, drivetoendhunger.org. You can find more information here and sign up for an appointment with a representative in your area. The drive also provides seniors with the opportunity for legal advice, tax information, and financial assistance. The AARP had 800 people sign up for its SNAP program in 2011, and they're hoping for even more this year. Live in the newsroom, I'm Brandon Burton. Thanks, Brandon.